All right, all right. Check it, check it out. Welcome back to Xenonauts 2. We are here for yet another glorious episode. Let's get it. Oh man, Xenonauts 2. We are back trying to fight off the alien invasion. Now look, we're going to get right into it. The last episode was crazy. We got a lot of stuff done. We're building our team. So I'm just super excited to get right into it without any delay. Let's get it. All right, all right. We're back here on the Geoscape, and things look quiet for now. We're currently at day 41, and we got a couple of things we got to do around the base. First and foremost, we got our hangar that's going to be up in a day. I want to get another interceptor just in case one gets wounded. We'll have another one on deck. We might eventually get another hangar to start building a new Skyhawk later on, but for now, we're good. Speaking of that, let's go into the engineer screen, and I'm going to hire two more engineers because we have the, well, we waiting for the living capacity, right? Let's check. Yeah, we're currently waiting five days for more living capacity. So, yep. All right. After five days, we'll get the engineers, but we can start the construction of the aircraft or at least get it queued up, right? Oh, we, we actually need the hangar. So, all right, whatever. Once we get these weapons going, we'll get this stuff queued up. We can do the air weapons, though. 30 alloys. Not yet. Not yet. I want to make sure everybody got the uh, appropriate weapons before we spin the alloys like that. So I think we're good with just taking off time. If we go to our soldiers real quick, I did a little bit of editing off camera. A few people just gained a lot more strength points, so they got a couple of more things in their kit. Specifically, our shield guy has more things in the kit. Um, this person can now carry three flashbangs, and I think our sniper can now carry to smoke so people are getting their strength up and look at our heavy our heavy is a gutter 66 accuracy so our our a team right now is looking sharp if we take a look at our a team it's nasty looking sharp actually we actually have some more equipment i just noticed we actually have the laser shotgun so yeah we have one of the laser shotguns let's get that going now yep let's take off this and we'll add one battery one battery is good for now. That's about eight shots. Maybe we need to add two batteries. I'm not sure. Wait, hold on. It might make more sense. It might make more sense to give the stronger person the shotgun for now because they can carry all of the necessary batteries they're going to need. Yeah, I can actually take away this smoke just to give them two batteries. That's perfect. They could probably do three batteries. Nope, two batteries is perfect. Now we can take the time off a bit. And try to get some more weapons done before we get into another battle. Oh yeah, let's let's view that. What do we just get? Another laser pistol? Perfect. Our shield person can level up. The accelerator weaponry can go to someone else, actually. Who's a secondary gun wielder? Sniper. You can get an accelerated pistol at the moment yeah um i'll probably give you more ammo for your pistol if that's going to be the case all right perfect sniper's still good what do we got going we need another precision laser and a laser machine gun all right cool so about four days we'll have everything so day 46 oh both cleaner cells have now been revealed destroying a cell with the cleaner activity link regions give the opportunity to collect additional cleaner data this will also weaken the cleaner headquarters by removing that associated bonus from the defenders okay oh hangers finished all right good we can start queuing up the the aircraft perfect let's get let's get an angel interceptor queued up immediately good and we still got some time. We're not going to attack these just yet. I want to get some more alloys and things going. I want to make sure we fully equip before we go in on these cleaner bases. View engineering project. Good. We got the precision laser. Let's equip that immediately. Sniper. He's going to take the precision laser. You can drop a lot of these ordnance and possibly the other one. Let's see how much you can carry. A decent amount. The laser is very light. Um, he can probably get some more equipment back. And probably carry an extra precision battery. Mm, one time unit taken away. Nah, I'm not going to make him suffer time units like that. You know what? 
I don't think he's going to need all 15 shots from his regular gun, right? So that that adds up. That 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 looks a lot better. And he'll get stronger and he'll eventually be able to carry an extra clip anyway. Then he'll get a laser rifle soon anyway. So let's try to get this machine gun before we get into another battle, shall we? On the six, we should be able to get it. View base. Yes, we got the necessary engineers. Let's immediately hire them. First day. With without delay. Hundred thousand. Yes, now we got 10 engineers, 10 scientists. We could go 12, but we're not going to do that. We're going to get the Xeno plot in about three hours. That's also amazing. Let's take the time shortly. All right, good. Xeno biology. Now we can do stun batons and things like that. View engineering. Good. We got the machine gun. So what we're going to do real quick. I know I'm moving real fast, but we need all of this stuff done now. We're going to make um, a stun gun and a stun baton, but I want this the stuff to go first. Yeah, we'll get it in about a day i guess two stun guns and one stun baton yeah i like this um gun baton gun and maybe another baton later on you know what i'll cancel that for now we're gonna use one good but i want it to go in this order then we'll worry about everything else good so in about a day we'll get all of that stuff Assign research project. Good. Heavy lasers, quantum teleport, dragonfly. I want the dragonfly ship. Honestly, I do. Let's get that going. That carries 12 people. So, perfect. Finally, our machine gun can get his new weapon. Drop these regular ordnance. Pick up some laser batteries. And he'll eventually get... Um, I don't know if he needs three laser batteries. These are 50 30 clips let's let's go with this for now let's just give him a normal damn he can carry a lot well oh i'm wilding i'm wilding no 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 he should definitely have that armor piece on 100 percent. so we'll we'll drop the grenades for now yeah he should definitely have that armor piece on nothing to talk about there and how much did this weigh? Six. All right, cool. So he's perfect. He should definitely have that heavy arm on. I don't know what's going on with him. He should be just as tanky as the assaults, in my opinion. Now, we do want another laser shotgun if we could. We've been running double. Hmm. Maybe we should go accelerated shotgun. Save some on save on alloys. Yeah. Yeah, let's start the let's let's start the production of that after we get the baton. Yeah, yeah, immediately after we get the baton. So if we last two days, we should be able to get it done. Stun gun, good. Let's give the stun gun to the sniper or the heavy, maybe. Yeah, the heavy. He doesn't have a good gun. Let's give him the stun gun with some ordnance. Perfect. Adds up perfectly. Now, the baton is probably going to go to one of the assaults. Let's just tick that off real quick. Good. View engineering. Let's go in and give it to the assault that can carry the most stuff. This guy. He's going to drop... Yeah, he's going to drop his healing and pick up the stun baton equipment. And he can actually carry more stuff. This guy's lethal. Okay, um, well, we want him to be able to suppress things in a lot, right? So let's go to equipment and give him an extra flashbang. Since he's going to be stunning things, we want to suppress before we stun. Now, the next thing we want to do is just get this next shotgun. Hopefully, we can get it before our next battle. We should have it by the 8th. We got the engineers. View personnel report. Everybody's healthy. People, Our A-team is getting even back. Yeah, everybody's healthy. Everybody's looking good. You should have this goddamn shotgun by now. Nine hours. All right, cool. We will get it. We'll get it. We'll get it. There we go. Accelerated shotgun, baby. Now we fully equipped. Let's go to our weaker assault. I say weaker, meaning in strength, not like overall weaker. 
uh, you got to drop something. It's always good to drop the grenades. The grenades aren't as useful as everything else. How much is these, this ammo for? Not really. We good. We good with the eight shots. All right, cool. Now we're fully ready to go. We're good for any, any type of mission, but we're going to wait for a UFO. View stun baton. Now, wait, 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 wait. Can we sneak another laser weapon in? We, it's worth it for me. Let's see. Who, who's going to need it the most? To be honest, we only need one more laser shotgun. I just made that shotgun for nothing. We honestly only need one more laser shotgun, and I don't know why I'm being cheap with it. I'm going to get it after... I'm going to get it after the interceptor is done. I want the interceptor in, inside the hangar before I do anything. So I, I, I'll live with that. Oh, we got the interceptor that quick. Okay, good. Uh, That's it. We don't need to make anything else for the moment. Maybe another stun gun or something or... <sighs> I guess it's trying to make the base upgrade. See, yeah, we got to stop. We got to chill out. We need a lot more alenium. See, we got to chill out. We need these base upgrades. So, yeah, we need a we need a UFO. Finally, launch interceptors. We got all three of them up too. Launch. Let's go. We got to. Oh no 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 no. Tail target. Tail into overland. Yes, we don't want to shoot this down. And it's not over land. All right, now shoot it down. Good. We still got good fuel. Order resolve attack. Ooh, he took down one by 50. All right, good. Angel three interceptors. Accept results. Oh, it's a destroyer class. This is a big joint. It crashed in the mountains somewhere. All right, we're headed out. Let's show mission briefing. All right, good. I think we're good to go. Um, launch combat team. Launch aircraft. We good to go. Everybody's good to go. We just did this. We make sure our soldiers are ready before we even take the mission. Oh, man, I'm excited. I want to get a better gun for this, too. I definitely want a better gun eventually for this thing. But for now, we good. Launch, baby. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I, can I equip that now? Wink, wink. Please. Oh, we already in the drop ship. We can't do it. I could return to base. I won't lose much time. Hold on, let me see. Wait, hold on. Give me... No, return to base. Now, no, give me this. Oh, I, I might have, I might have launched, let too much time pass, but whatever. I'll take the risk. I'll definitely take the risk to get another shotgun, laser shotgun on the field. All right, we should be good with the launch now. Everybody's good. Assault, assault, heavy, heavy, baton. Everything's good. Let's go. All right, now we can do a quick launch. Commence tactical battle, baby. All right, all right. Got to eliminate all hostiles or take over the UFO and hold it for three turns. All right, we usually going to just go for the elimination. We are on a jungle map and contact off the rip. What do we got? Sectoids. All right. So we got some sectoids. We might be able to capture one or two of them. That'll help us out a lot. We got some sectoids right in our grill. Let's see what Mr. Sniper can do from here. He doesn't really have a shot, though. Um, He can get somewhere to get a good shot, I bet. First off, let's let's check our flanks before we make any decisions. Yeah, I'm more interested in clearing these flanks before we even worry about this dude all the way down there. Our flanks are more important, so let's get to that. So far, looks clear. Like, I don't know what else to say. 
but I do want to check the front. So let's move out with this guy first. All right, left, right seems clear. We're going to head toward the sectoid, maybe. I kind of want to head up towards this way, but not until I clear that flank. So speaking of clearing that, let's go take a peek right here. We can take a peek, and if there's any danger, we could always just back off. Let's get a little more vision. All right, we're kind of good. We might tuck this dude in over here because even it might still be some trouble that we just can't see yet. So let's tuck him in and keep him with a shot available. I'm gonna kinda do the similar thing over here and YOLO a bit and pray nobody's back here. All right, we got nobody back there, good. We could kinda just duck. He's not gonna hold this, this corner. He's kinda just there so he don't get shot right now. We wanna kinda hold this corner with somebody else. Now, I wonder if we step out, can we get a good shot on this dude now? 62. Not great. Not great. I'm pretty sure with this open lane here, we might be getting a better shot this way. But it's a lot of people in the way, so we can't do that just yet. So, um, we got good vision on our starting location. I kind of just want to set up. We got amazing vision here. Kinda just wanna just set up. This fucking guy moves. He's gonna get ripped. Like I could even suppress him right now, probably. Yep, I knew it. Like, yeah, he's suppressed. We don't gotta worry too much about him. We might even get the kill on him. Just cause. We're gonna get some good people lined up in a good firing line here. Yep. If he even if he even breathes, he's gonna take some losses so let's try to cover this this building as much as we can oh, i know i'm spinning the camera but let's try to cover this cat this building a bit i want to get an eye on up this lane real quick and maybe i should just do it with this thing all right still nothing We got a lot of good we got we got some shots if we just hold our position here we can shoot so i'm a, that's exactly what i'm gonna do probably get some fire over here too He could even duck and still be effective. Oh, did I waste the duck? I did. Uh, I'm going to keep him like that. All right, now let's try to get the best shot on this thing. I'm going to take the shot. We need 47 to get our best accuracy. 83%. I'll take it. And he fucking missed. Welcome to XCOM, folks. Um, just turn that way. Oh, that was a terrible miss. I think everybody else is good. We're good. I could duck my shield just to get more cover, but I think we're good. Okay, hello. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, fuck. They are determined to get a kill here. Good, a delete. Holy shit. Oh, good claps. Good claps. Alright, somebody just took two blind shots from in there somewhere. That's what it feels like. They didn't, they didn't hit anything. This is interesting. Oof. He needs health, like, immediately. I don't think he can do anything but run towards healing. Honestly. Wait. Might be able to do 
you something. This is a 60% chance. That's 51. I wonder what, what, what does he do if he miss? Because I could get him healing. Oh, I actually used the wrong dude to throw that. I wanted to use him. But whatever. Yeah, we got the one kill and you just run as far this way as you possibly can. Thank you. You need to be able to come here and heal this guy. Please, please be able to do it. 25 time units. I think we got it. I think we got it. All right. 23 HP heal. Perfect. Turn around, duck. We'll deal with that other one. That other sectoid for sure. Then we'll kind of regroup. Yep. Sort of like that. We might even pop a smoke. Just, <laughs> I'm afraid of what's over here, man. Um... Oh, we can throw a flare. That's beautiful. Let's actually do that. We can see that far, too. All right. Uh, we got a lot more vision. We need to see what's over there, though. Anybody else got flare money? You got flare money. Yeah. It's not going to be that accurate, but fuck it. We can't, can't get choosy. All right, bet. We at least cleared that side of the map. All right. Um... Hold? <laughs> Hold your positions? I mean, we can take a peek over here, right? I don't think it's going to hurt to take a peek over here. Yeah, we kind of kind of clear. I, I have to check that. Even though it's going to cost me useless time units. Um, I'll duck. Yeah, I'll duck. Fuck it. We got some firepower over here. Um, I think we just hold tight for one turn and let these people regroup. Actually, you can actually give them some support and fire like that. You're good there. You're good there. Everybody's good. Oh, the sniper didn't do anything yet. Oh, fuck. Well. Uh, just duck. Just duck. All right, that's a good sign. We got four kills already, so, you know, we're not doing terrible, to say the least. Uh, who's our, who's going to be able to haul last and not immediately die? I have to search this corner. I don't want to. I don't want to haul ass all the way over here, but I kind of have to. We had too much activity over here to not see what's going on let's go tuck your ass back in the corner you can't even oh shit now we're not even going to be a protect them we're going to move up slow with everybody else we can't sacrifice everybody he's got good time units maybe we'll use him to gain ground and get a little bit of vision Oh, we got a shotgun bro over there. All right. A shotgun bro. No more vision, huh? You know what? You know what? You know what? Screw it. Just give... Let me see what's over here. Yeah, I was afraid the flare might not work like that. But at least we got a little more vision. And you can duck even. Good. Good, 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 good. We gained a lot of good ground. Let's... I'm going to rip through this building. Just because I'm sick of this shit. We need to see what's over here. Move up slightly. Turn. I'm not going to go crazy. Because we don't have much support. So I think that's a lot of ground gained. And a lot of good ground. That we can depend on. So let's just move our shotgun guy up. Our shotgun bro can kind of get in here and duck. We know it's clear. 
should also move up the rifle. And he can move up and then keep his snapshot available. And he don't need to duck. I'm, I'm, I'm a little worried about this little alleyway. You know what? Let's just go see if it's something to worry about. Nothing to worry about. So far, so good. Uh, dude, should we keep him here or hide him? We, we should probably back this thing off a bit and not let it take useless shots of damage. All right, that's good movement, good ground, good everything. He's going to swing wide. He might need some support because this is the edge of the map, though. Um, Maybe just going to tuck yourself there is the best option for now. Yeah, you're going to be taking good shots and we want you to be somewhere valuable within a turn or two. We got this whole lane clear. Let's move you up a bit that way. We don't need you to be able to take a shot. Just 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 get clear. And we can search behind these trees just to be safe. All right, that's all good. You don't need to be able to take a shot either. Just duck and avoid any unnecessary damage. All right, we're good. I'm going to move him first. I'm worried about this side of the map the most. And you know what? I'll pop a flare over there just to be safe. And that'll clear this entire side of the map for the most part. Damn, this map is huge. All right. Can we get any more ground? We can. Uh, turn and duck. All right. That's a lot of ground we gained. Um, and We have no eyes on a UFO yet. That's not great. And we don't got no eyes on the next group of enemies. It's also not great. I almost feel like I'm forced to just launch flares and duck. There we go. We got it. We got it, boys. We got it, boys. Right, we want to be able to take some shots at it. We know where it's at now. We know where it's at now. We want to be able to take some shots at it. These people are going to come around through this through this area. So let's finish clearing. Can you can you scuttle all the way that way? You can get there and duck. Let's do that and pray. Oh, that was a good prayer. I know you can get pretty far, but I might need you to take a quick hot shot just in case they get active oh we get we, we we get the close in yeah we get the close in all right all right we can actually close the distance this turn and really see what they're doing at this ufo so let's move up everybody get some real eyes on the scenario can you get a, a, a flash over there anything oh they jerking us on light all right whatever you can't see that either? All right. Um, Where's the best spot for the sniper? Probably somewhere along these lines. It's probably too far to move in this turn. So we're going to get you here. Yeah, we're going to get you there. He should probably be somewhere right here in the next few turns. Who didn't move yet? A big gunner, right? Yeah, we need you over here ASAP. We need you to haul ass, buddy. You might even get shot. You're going to move so fast. We need you to haul ass. We can't afford to hold up any overwatches with you. And I don't even think your overwatch is worth it at the moment. You can move forward too. Just go here and duck. We don't need overwatches at the moment. You can turn though. All right. That's everybody using most of their time units. The only thing we have left is this thing. Um, Use it for scouting. Let's make it move maximum time units now so it can move further next turn.
Oh, fuck. We got overzealous. We did. He came out the woodwork. Sheesh. I said he might get shot. I said he might get shot. He's going to move so fast. He's going to double time it. So, yeah. All right. Now we know we need to check that flank. We were going to check it anyway, for sure. But, oh, we missed all of those shots. Can I just bomb you from here? Like, I don't feel like dealing with this dude right now. Fuck. Okay, 71. Yeah, let's just melt this fucker. Fuck, he's not dead yet? Thank you. Jeez. Jeez Louise. All right, cool. Um... Yeah, we're going to have to keep sweeping this edge. I don't think we have a choice here. We just, these dudes just ran out of the woodwork on us. I don't think we have a choice but to keep an eye on that flank. That could have been way worse than it was just now. And we definitely need to close the gap and get eyes on this UFO. Fuck, see what I mean? Damn. That might straight up be a death. Which was very careless of me, but, uh, yeah. Damn, I don't understand. I hope it's not a death. This, it's not sure. It's not guaranteed to be a death, but it very well could be. It very well could be. We could have just blew it right there. But, you know, there's a way to recover this. Did he get a 100% chance to kill, to shoot this guy? Thank you. I'll take it. Wait, what's going on over there? What type of cover do you have? None. Just get back behind cover and turn slightly. You, though. Can we get you anywhere near this thing? Not really. We can kind of get you on the side of it. We took a loss here. And that might be a death. A flat-out death. And we there's no way to know until, you know... Ah, uh, that feels bad. But, you know, you gotta take risk. You gotta take risk. Absolutely. Admittedly, those were a little bit unnecessary, but, you know, I'm not gonna cry over spilt milk. Especially when I'm the one that spilt it. Alright, let's get it. I should've checked that corner with the, with the truck first. I didn't think this patch of trees was gonna be a problem, but there you go. XCOM. Look, I already knew the serious potential for a high amount of aliens on this map. So, with the destroyer class being a thing, so that was on me from the get-go. Alright, first things first, we're down a guy. And there's definitely more than one alien. In that ship, at least. 110%. So, first thing, we need a full clear gonna be again risky but we need a full clear we can't afford to move in on this thing until we know there's nothing over here and we still got a blind spot all right whatever we did the best we could do on that side this guy is visible he's definitely visible and he can get shot with a hundred percent accuracy I'm shooting him. We, even if we miss, we couldn't miss. Same thing with this guy. Alright, that's good. That's not a successful breach, but it's as good as it's gonna get. Should we breach now? No, we close the gap. We close the gap. We definitely close the gap. There's no reason to get spooky now. We got the door covered. They're not going to come out the, the spaceship. As long as we keep the door covered like this. So let's just put everybody in an advantageous position on the door specifically. And get people moving. Yeah, even if this is just getting them right there. I don't care. We need to get everybody moving. The door is going to close anyway.
Yeah, we good. Oh, fuck. Two of them. Oh, we're blowing them the fuck up. Oh, hell no. Oh, do they door even work? I'm not sure if they door even works. Hold on. I don't I don't know what's going on, but we're blowing this to fucking smithereens. We missed that? Oh, that is bad. How we miss a 70? That is a bad miss. Um We need ordnance though. I don't wanna risk. We could do this and then probably go in for a suppress later. Oh, good. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, We have this room to worry about in this room. So, yeah, let's get somebody on this door. Because we have to breach that way. And we're probably going to have to breach straight ahead. So, let's get some people on these doors, too. Probably gonna crouch you my good friend you can just come in here you know what i need to get people in here we need to get in these rooms to be real with you we don't need to be fucking around we need to get in these goddamn rooms and get in them now i'll put you there fuck it you get a few shots and we need a shield a meat shield you're gonna play shield you don't have any time units. Can you even turn? Yeah, you can turn. All right, we got some other folk that need to haul ass and get inside the UFO. Uh, but fuck it. We need to search. We got to search. If you don't search, you die. All right, let's go check. All right, all right. Ring around the goddamn Rosie. Nobody's there. Great. Double time. Haul ass. Sniper. Sniper guy. You need to be where you can't get shot. So move up there for now. I don't need you to do much else. Just duck. Everybody else is inside the craft, right? Yeah, pretty much. All right, we're good. In turn. All right, they've got to be in this back compartment here. So I'm just going to set up some mean overwatches and get my guy back in action as fast as possible and probably get some people healed up. Yeah, let's get him double timing. We're, we're going to need this shotgun. We're going to need this rifle, I mean. Um... Yeah, I'm just going to set up some decent overwatches. I'm going to be honest with you. basically basically what i'm gonna do we'll open these doors in a minute not right now got some folk first things first let's see all right we can get out of the gun in there not going to be effective but it's in there all right now everybody's in the craft right so that means next turn we got full capabilities of breaching both rooms with maximum efficiency let's just take a peek for now and see what's in here oh fuck they're gonna do this like really what the hell What?
Oh, you fucking bitch. I could clap, but he might clap back. But I could run out the way, though. Yeah, fuck out of here. Damn it. All right, the moment of truth. <laughs> Yo, they survived. Yes. Oh, man, everybody survived. Both assaults got heavily wounded. 20 days. Purple hearts. Crimson hearts. They deserve it, man. They worked out. They did. Oh, man. Laura Young survived. Bruno Torres survived. Everybody else got great stats, man. Man, I'm starting to feel like this Mars is slowing our progression down a bit. But we got a bunch of alenium, a bunch of alloys, dope stuff. Oh, man, that was dope. She survived. Yes. And we got good backups. Oh, man, dope stuff. Let's head back to base, man. Let's head back to base, man. Ooh, that was a rough mission. A rough one. We're going to have to... Yeah, UFO class, destroyer. Perfect. Assign research project. Oh, man, yo. Man, we're going to have to figure this stuff out later. Let's just check our peoples real quick. Our soldiers, yeah, they automatically got taken off the active roster. It feels like everybody got a little nicked up, but nah, it was just our assaults taking most of that damage. Man, we on our B team when it comes to the assaults low-key. Yeah, the only two active assaults we got right now that we could even think about bringing in are BT assaults. We could change a heavy or something to an assault. But so far, this person, Diaz Adu, let's assign Diaz to the Hawk. Man, yo, man. And we really need to bring back Samantha Brown. She's good. These are these are good, these are good assaults. They just don't got an extremely large amount of time units like these people like these dudes look at the time units they're working with they're like crazy and the strength is off the charts and laura young's accuracy is bananas so we got some good replacement assaults this is why it's always good to have a good barracks because we could immediately just assign some good people and get right back into action there we go fully ready again and we could actually we could drop the double assault approach and let's see who has decent accuracy because there's another approach i like this guy has decent accuracy but the time units are suffering there's a like making making your heavies with good accuracy is op in my opinion but we got the three riflemen we could do four riflemen we could go um double sniper double sniper is pretty good especially when we got we got the extra accelerated rifle so we might want to train up a sniper let's see who we got um we got this person that should be doing sniper training now we might sit the mars down and bring out a private next time around who else do we have that can start sniper training realistically one person one person that can realistically start sniper training but we could switch Nick Barnes over the sniper. Nick, look at look at Nick Barnes, seventy five accuracy, just as much as the sniper. You know what? I might switch Nick Barnes over the sniper and allow this person to come in on rifleman training. I'll decide. I'll decide next time. Next time around, then we'll have to sit the Mars down. Bring that person in on rifleman training to replace Nick Barnes, and Nick Barnes can go into double sniper. We could do double sniper, double assault, and heavy, and go out like that. We'll make that decision later on. Right now, we got the barracks. Um, We want to just make sure at the very least they got their warden almost. Everything else. Yeah. We back in action, baby. And we could take so much more ordnance. And this is why we need to make sure we got a lot of. Oh, we didn't equip another stun person, right? Yeah. Who's got the most strength? 65, 65. They're equal on strength. Somebody has to drop a healing pack to try to get some of that going. Can you actually take? Yeah. All right.
strong arm. Fully equipped. You can definitely get double. And we prioritize smoke over here. Because we always got explosives right here. I could send you out with a lack of time units. But you, you're already suffering on time units. So we won't do that. I think we're back in full form. Yep. A couple of people got some more strength things going on. Like our riflemen are just getting beastly. Our riflemen are just becoming disrespectful out there. Man. Alright, well. We're prioritizing... Stuns. I mean, they got the time units to spare. They got the time units to spare, and they'll gain a little bit more strength for doing so, but I don't know if I want to do that with everybody just yet. Yeah, I'd rather just let them not take out a grenade than let them suffer on time units in this, in this point in the game. All right, everybody's in full form. But yeah, dope stuff, man. We had a scare. We had a scare. We almost lost somebody. But now we only got 20 days. They'll be back next month ready to go. Dope stuff. We got to worry about these cleaner bases too next time around. We're probably going to head over and deal with this one right on our coast. Right in the coast of Miami. Dope stuff, man. Dope stuff. All right. All right. We're going to end the video here. If you're interested in playing this game, we got some information in the description box below. I appreciate you for tuning in. I'll catch you in the next one. It's your boy DB4, and I'm out. Peace.